can the devil show up? If it does, is it real? So when I was away, y'all, look so exciting. Our trash cans are here. So we got our recycle bin and we have our waste bin. Don't buy anything. I just took Nova tear down. And I wanted to show y'all these roller blinds. I already showed it on my story on Instagram. So if you haven't already followed me, make sure you follow me at Ashley Now Swiper. So I put up one in the garage. And then we have one. What are you doing, girl? Bye-bye. One in the dining room. In here, we're going to do draping from floor to ceiling. So we have to get a custom rod. And we also custom drape. So our ceilings are 28 inches or feet or whatever <laughs> i may just say that wrong is i don't know what wow, wow, wow. and then they're 28 wide i think that's what it was so 28 wide and then 12 up and down so i already did the measurements for those still gotta clean this up every time i clean up this area the girls bring some form of toy i'm doing laundry so y'all may hear the washing machine in the background because we still got our old one because we're waiting for our new one to ride. I'm trying, I'm talking to y'all while I'm showing this. Cause I'm looking bummy still. I'm still looking bummy. But not for long. Today's the day I don't care what nobody else does. But today I'm getting myself together. Today is, uh, what's today? Friday, it's Friday, it's Friday. This is our first one week in the house. I was like, okay, I have not posted on my feed to tell anyone. I'm gonna get myself together. But back to the window treatment and all the upgrades we've done so far. We put roller blinds up on all of these downstairs and of course, like I told y'all, we wanna do floor to ceiling drapes. And the reason why we wanted to do that because we love this scene. So we don't wanna have curtains. I know what y'all gonna say, well, you can roll the curtains up. What, you can do the roller blinds and you can let it. No, it's gonna take away from the beauty of this so I'm gonna put an inspo up right here of what we are going for yeah I really want floor to ceilings and then in our bedroom we're gonna do the remote blinds here just because I want to wake up and push the button like <laughs> that will be such a vibe so roller blinds are just in the front of the house because we want everything to be matchy matchy of course instead of going all the way up to the top we wanted to make sure we just hit it right here so everything can be symmetrical to the other ones. And I had a lot of people asking on Instagram, where do we get this lamp from? So we got this lamp from Home Goods. A lot of our furniture came from Home Goods, and a lot of the new things this has come from Crate and Barrel are the main two. IKEA came through with the girls' bed, so I got their beds and their table which is originally an end table, but I got it for $12.99 because of course that's how much it costs, it costs $12.99. It's like kids furniture can be expensive because these little chairs were $30 each. So, but if I wanted to get the table set, that was from Home Goods because I got this chair from Home Goods. If I wanted to get the table set, it was like $129. So I paid 70 bucks instead of $129. Got this cute little organizer from Home Goods as well. This dollhouse was a gift. I can't remember where, but it's massive. It's like three feet. But yeah, so far that is the upgrades. And then we put film on the doors because like we didn't want neighbors looking all up in here. We felt very much exposed. So just imagine like walking past your door and anybody who was walking, riding their bikes, driving, they could see right into the house because it was super transparent. Like those windows there. <laughs> So, but yeah, my hair is so dry. <laughs> it was so hydrated the last few days, but now it's officially dry, so I need to wash and style it. But so far I have gotten <laughs> the box. Let me sit y'all down. They're slowly minimizing, so I went ahead and did Will's closet. I'm doing our, well, my closet now. No, I'm doing Will's closet now. My closet is gonna be a work in progress. And if I do show you my closet, just be optimistic because it's not gonna stay that way. My camera almost fell. It's not gonna stay that way because I gotta get shelves built in. Right now, well, I have shelves. I need drawers built in because I don't wanna have a dresser in our bedroom. So the box has gotten smaller. It may not look like it, but it has gotten smaller. 
Those are our chairs that we got from Sarah Sales. And then I bought that pendant from this like, um, I can't think of what type of store it's supposed to be. It's, it's similar to like Goodwill, but instead they have brand new items. These bar suits are such a vibe. I have so many inspo pictures with like that style of bar stew and how I'm gonna have the kitchen set up and I'm thinking about changing these pendants. But let me take y'all to our bedroom so I can show you Will's closet. <laughs> Disregard that Miss child in that one. These are all the empty shoe boxes. I hate shoe boxes. And I've been telling him for years not to keep his shoe box. Granted, we didn't have enough space everywhere else we've lived so far so i understand so while he's at work doing my wifely due diligence and getting his closet together okay let me close this because this is loud child but i got the tennis shoes well some of his tennis shoes up here that he barely wear and then i have all his dress shoes here because i don't know if i told you guys we'll wear suits to work or polos so I need his dress shoes to be easy access. And then all his blazers. <laughs> this baby, this so old. This from 2018. Yes, daughter? Talk to my daddy. You done yeah. talking to your daddy? Were you so happy to talk to him this morning? Yeah. I'm so happy you got a chance to talk to him. Do you, do Will closet look better now? That mommy put all no. his clothes in? No, yeah. the shoes out. It's messy, isn't it? Well, not for long. I bet it be clean. Before he yeah, gets on. Well, I'm going to clean it. I'm going to clean it. I'm not going to be tired. I got mommy superpowers. Okay, so this blazer was from 18 too. So these two. What would you say? Watch I be tired? Yeah, watch I won't say nothing. Okay, go get your sister. So, I like this deal, but he doesn't. I think it was the wrong fit. So, that's what the issue is. So, I'm not done hanging all his clothes because during the summertime. Yes, daughter? Hi, baby. Mom about to comb your hair in just a moment. So during the summertime, he wore polos instead of his dress shirt. So I'm gonna have his slacks here, polos there, and dress shirts here. So down here is gonna be like all work essentials. And then, of course, the blazers right above it and trench coat. So slacks, I'm moving those because those look more, ca more casual. So I'm gonna put them behind here so you really can't see them. And then dress shirts down here. But during the move, a lot of his dry cleaning, we ruined. So I'm gonna earn all of these and hang them in the closet as well. I went ahead and I hate wire hangers. Told him to stop doing that too. So I took away all the wire hangers in the plastic and I got him matching hangers. So he's gonna have all these black suede hangers cause it has none slip. And it just looked better. It looks way cleaner that way. Like I forgot. I had some uh, black suede hangers with gold hook and put them on the items that I'm gonna have back here that you can't see. So you just see the silver hook and it just looks way more cleaner that way. Love these suede hangers, got them from Ross. I feel like they were $11.99. It was a pack of, hi Ashley, nappy hair, look my hair flat in the back of the other day. But I feel like those suede hangers were $11.99 for a pack of 30, which is good. If you shop anywhere else for them, I think they're like super, super expensive. So go to Ross, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, all of those stores, and also Home Goods have those velvet hangers as well in all colors. I like to do the black ones, but for my closet, I said I want to do the white ones for mine. So we won't get our hangers mixed. We won't get our hangers mixed up because I will hate for Will to take my hangers. But baby, look at look at my closet baby last time y'all seen my closet on the empty house tour i don't think y'all realized how big baby how big my closet is baby can y'all hear me over here this is from wall to wall then i still got this space over here so let me show you <laughs> oh we can play high do together i've never in my life had a closet this big never I don't even have enough clothes to fill this closet. I literally have enough clothes just to fill this wall here. And I gave away a lot of stuff during the moving process. Shoes, clothes, everything. So, I'm like, I 
get a bath some more. Got my little shoes right here so far. <sighs> I just had to hurry up and take these out the box. My husband got me these for, what he gave me these for? My birthday? He gave me them for my birthday. So, I got those. Oh, I'm the baby. I have my wedding shoes already. Of course, I haven't had my wedding yet. <laughs> yes, I said my wedding. I didn't say ours because you know why? It ain't for the men yet. So, here are my wedding shoes. Been having these for two years because we were originally supposed to have our wedding in 2020. Got pregnant with Nova. And then, of course, pandemic hit. So, we said 2021 was gonna, we were gonna have our wedding, but then we decided to buy this house, which we started this process July of 2021, and we knew it would be finished 2022 spring, but it was really finished 2022 summer, which is May. But here is my wedding shoe. I got a little baby here because you know when we be dancing and having fun and stuff, I gotta move around. I gotta move around, y'all, and be comfortable. But they are so cute. It's mesh with the sparkle. Shut up. Like, these are gorgeous. I got my shoes before I got my dress. But I already know what kind of dress I'm wearing. But we're wearing satin. We've done everything. We had the baby, we didn't got the house. We gotta have the wedding, even though we legally married already, but we still need to have the wedding. I need a wedding. He wanna have the wedding here too, and we're gonna do it right in the backyard, because why not? We got enough yard to do it. And you know how you see those movies on Lifetime, and shoot, Netflix too, you y'all see the movies, where they have backyard weddings, and they always be so beautiful, like, let me see. Y'all see our backyard? Look at that. And look at look at the trees back there. A blanket of trees. This would look so good to have our way there. And I think what I want to do too is end this vlog today and start fresh, y'all. I'm going to start fresh. It's been two weeks since I posted the vlog. And probably two and a half weeks now. And I hate making y'all wait like that. I, baby, I got to post every single week. Every single week because I don't need y'all thinking that y'all can just go on about y'all business and I ain't consistent. So today, we're going to end this vlog here. Thank y'all for watching. Come in and subscribe and give us all likes. Yeah. What's like that? Oh, is that girl hugging you up all the way? Yeah, look at her. Do you like her? That me. Oh, that's you? You made you in with a little ponytail? Look at Gabby Avatar. Yeah, I made you good. You made you good? So cute. What'd you say, Mom? They didn't garage blowing me up on FaceTime. For real? Yeah, because I just see Mark just text Gabby question mark. They must have been they texting Colin everybody. They don't know where you at. Girl, they knew where I was at. I was in that closet uh, putting Will's stuff up.